Hey friends, welcome back to another YouTube video of me playing The Sims. I'm in Inspiron 1520. We are here with Sabrina Shabata. Yay! It took a while, but we found her. Oh, oh in between loading, I, uh, pulled out that, that chicken tender that was already done. Um, oh, those are so good. I gotta tell you, a con girl. Oh my goodness, I've never had them before. They were on sale at New Thrills. Pin... Pinkies? Am I reading it right? Pinkies? P-I-N-T. Pinties. That's pint. Pinkies. Why can't I read today? Apparently, I have no idea how to read. Pint. Pinties? Pinties? Maybe? P-I-N-T-Y? Pinties? Pinties? Honey garlic flavored premium chicken breast chunks. Cooked, seasoned, and breaded chicken breast chunks. And they're authentic pub and grill style. Ooh, and they, they official partner of NASCAR. <laughs> uh, and the calories. All right. For five chicken chunks, is 160 calories. Okay, well, I... Even the teeny tiny little chunks? Okay. Yeah, alright. Oh, that's why I... They're really good. They taste just like, um... Like, pub style. Oh, they are. They're so good. So... Freaking delicious, delicious. Yeah, sometimes I have a hard time reading. I, uh, for one, I don't have the right kind of prescription glasses that I need for my eyes. So, um, I'm supposed to. I'm definitely actually really glad I held off on making the. Uh, I appointment because that money didn't come in so um I turn off the oven Ooh, let the heat shine through myself mm, okay what was I gonna say well, yeah I'm really glad I didn't make the uh, eye appointment because then I wouldn't have had the money to actually uh go and i would have had to cancel it for another you know little while so i'm really glad that i i didn't yeah but now that i know exactly when it's coming i will make a, an appointment oh the game was working really good and now it's sucky whatever are we surprised no we are not we are not surprised Alright, you're going to use the bathroom, and then you're going to have some lunch. So I guess you're just going to be a single mom, eh, and have a whole bunch of kids? Like, apparently? Yeah. Do you have a job? You do, you do have a job. Okay. You're a general practitioner. Alright. Alright, and then you can call a sim. You can call somebody because you you seem a little lonely or your social's on the downside, right? You know? So you should call a sim after you have some food. I really like this. I, I like how sometimes I really just put a, a lot of effort in my home. Okay. I gotta like turn I'm gonna start making that bacon. Open container. Yeah. So I'm thinking, because I know I'm I'm not a 
big fan of people who do live streams or anything like that. I don't like, I, I, here I am like all like blah a lot of the time and, and can't talk. And then, but I don't like the whole, I, I, I wouldn't, I, I need, I need more upbeat, whatever, or, alright. I always cut my bacon in half, so I got three half, not three, I'm lying to you, six half slices, so that, you know, three full slices of bacon, and I got four of those chicken tenders, and I got arugula, and I love arugula, I may even fry up an egg, ooh, I do love arugula and bacon, and Egg. Yeah. Alright. So, now that my bacon is cooking, we have a nice sizzling, delicious sound in the background. Uh, I was reading an article the other day about that Disney movie, Turning Red. You know, my daughter had seen it. Uh, and she really loved it. She, when she saw it on the previews last year, she was so excited because it's a turning of age story, right? You know, you're growing up, you're dealing with life, you know, but apparently some parents are finding it inappropriate because it, it deals with like a woman's period. Well, um, Sorry to burst those people's bubbles, but every single woman, with the exception of transgender women, bleed from their vagina. And, um, you know, honestly, I wish I didn't bleed from mine. It's uncomfortable. And it hurts. And, you know, we are jealous of those transgender women. Because they get to be women, you know, they get to live their truth and be who they are and not deal with periods, which, man, that just really is not fun. It really isn't. <sighs> but, like, I just, I don't understand why, like, why they... Would they think it's inappropriate? Should pe would little girls and little boys not learn about that stuff? It, you know, everyone should. Like, it's what bothers me the most about it is the parents who are so angry about it. Uh, oh shit. Um, okay, you can call him. Parents are so angry about this how inappropriate it is are the p same people who grew up with Degrassi like OG Degrassi and OG Degrassi Junior High there's a girl who she's um in band and she's in her band uniform and her band uniform it's, um, has white pants and she starts her period and it's in the middle of band. It, it happens. Like it's, it happens, right? So it, that's the issue. Like, why are they so mad over something that happens to everyone? And, you know, well, you know, like me, how I, um, I have issues with being a person a lot of the time. I have issues with making phone calls, which actually is going to be a video in the next little while. Like, I have issues. And it would be really great if I knew that other people felt the same way. And that's exactly what that type of coming of age story is. It's, it's important. Like, I talk to my daughter about everything. We, you know... We're pretty open about things. Sometimes she keeps secrets and things to herself because while she's 
almost 15 and there has to be a level of trust there you know but you also have to be able to like I just said you have to trust your kids you have to be able to talk to them and let them come to you and talk to you about anything that they feel that they can talk to you about or should, ow, I bet my tongue that hurt I'm oh my goodness you're tired you should go to sleep like ASAP Ugh. <sighs> okay yeah. yeah, so, I don't know, that's just, that's just what I'm thinking, I'm, I'm thinking that people should just mess right off, everyone who was naturally born with a uterus, because some men, some men have uteruses, and some men bleed from their vaginas, everyone who was born with a vagina and a uterus, they bleed from their, from it. They do. And it will happen. Every single one of them. So, like, do you want them to be, like, Carrie from the prom? Like, jeez, like, she, at the, one of the first opening scenes, she started her period. And because her mother was such a freaking nutso, she didn't know what it was. And got scared. Like, come on, guys. It's important. You, know, you have to talk to your kids about that stuff. If they don't, they're gonna think they're gonna die. Right? Like in my girl. She thought she was gonna die. Veda. Like, grow the fuck up. Stop being stupid. We all have issues. You know? Alright. Um. That's really just it. Just telling people to stop being stupid because people are stupid. Like, really. They really just have to complain about everything. I even saw, um, I didn't even, I didn't read the news article because if I did, I would have gotten more angry than what I am. And, oh, uh, uh, this girl was going on about how it's racist. I'm like, okay, I'm not even, I am not even going to, to give that person any kind of attention, because, oh, God, <laughs> it's worse than the fat, positive community saying that people, you know, fat people are being discriminated on their race when fatness isn't even a race, you know, make me want to just, like, backhand a lot of them all right well i hope you enjoy this video and hopefully i won't have as much trouble finding who's the next person here we got going on oh chris we know where he is we found him okay yay <laughs> awesome so uh i will see you guys in the next video Oh, if you like this video, click like. If you want to see more of me playing The Sims on my Instagram, 1520, hit subscribe. And yeah, bye.